was an Amish buggy. In case anyone wants to see one, that's what an Amish buggy looks like. Yes, we do have Amish people here. Um, I think uh, Burton is going to be having its fireworks tonight. So these are people that are actually set up. This is the uh, the Great Geauga County Fairgrounds. And they're not collecting money right at the moment. But I wanted to show you guys. Uh, this is a big part of my growing up. Um, in about two months, this place is going to be full of people. And, uh, I actually printed out some of the history. That domestic arts building right there and that flower building, those date back into the, uh, like the late 1800s. Um, like 18, I don't know, something, 18, middle of 1800s. And then one was rebuilt. I don't know what happened to it, if it was a fire or what, but... Um, those are actually on the National Register of Historic Places. Um, the Great Geauga County Fair in Burton is actually one of the longest continuous running fairs in the county. And I believe it is the longest um, continuous running fair in the country as well. And it's like a quarter of a million people come here every year for the for the fair. I'll probably show you some before and after pictures or you know when when nobody's here and then during the fair if we come I'll take some pictures and stuff and maybe do a follow-up on this video but that's the domestic arts. The first one was um, in 1823 I think they had a uh, like a cattle and uh, Used to be manufacturing as well, but they uh, they took the manufacturing part out of it, and it just became basically an agricultural fair. Um, that's the produce building. This is like the uh, fine arts building here. Actually, um, it was this farm produce building. When I was a kid, I had a Fiero, and I didn't drive it in the winter time. And you can uh, in the over the winter you can uh, store your cars. In these buildings, they like run out the space inside of them. So I stored my car in here. And that's the flower building where they have all the flowers. And they usually have little concerts in this gazebo right here. This is all farm products. They have uh, just everything you can imagine. So I'm going the wrong way, it looks like. Um, but this is like the fairgrounds. This is all the little buildings that you can go through. And there'll be fireworks here tonight. This is where the uh, the uh, Joggy County Fair Band will be set up in play. And that's uh, the antique building, that red building right there. And there's an old tank. Now there's restrooms in case you need one. Junior Fair Building. I have this marked off, but that's where all the cows are, and the dairy cattle, the pigs, the rabbits, the chickens, the horses. That's actually the uh, the milking thing for the the cows. They line them up in there and hook them up to be milked. So that actually turns into dirt down there somewhere, so I'll probably stay up here. They got llamas down there and pigs and just about every kind of farm animal you can imagine. Now when I was a kid, I was in, um, I was in uh, police explorers, so you rode around with the police and um, Believe it or not, they only had uh, 
police until about one or two o'clock in the morning in Burton. I don't, I don't know if that's changed or not. But the, the place where they uh, used to store the vehicle at night was in the, this, this garage right here. That's where the police vehicles would get, get parked inside that garage there. And then during the fair, there's fire trucks, different fire departments that come and stock the fire station there. And there's the main grandstand. I'll show you here. That's the main grandstand over there with the, um, the dirt track and stuff out there where the horses, they have some horse races here. The demolition derby will be out there, the, the tractor pulls, all that stuff during the fair. So. Like I said, they'll have fireworks here tonight. And this will all be uh, concessions along each side of these midways. It'll all be concessions and games and um, all the fair rides and stuff are, <laughs> all the fair rides and stuff are down there where that white fence are, fences and stuff. Maybe they're having a dog show. That's what they're having here today. This is a dog show. Interesting, it's a dog show. Uh -huh. There'll be more uh, concessions and games and stuff and all kinds of stuff in through here. I'm assuming they're having the fireworks here tonight. But that looks like a dog show. That'd be interesting to see. There's a greyhound. Looks like they paved this new. There'll be more stuff down on... This is where all the, the um, farm products usually get displayed down that side there. And then there's another stage that they set up over here in between these. But, yep, this is Geauga County's fairgrounds. There's the Geauga County uh, Memorial Building. And they've got the uh, Memorial Bell up there in the top of it. And there's the little sheriff's building and the treasurer's office. And this, um, that's a historical society. I think that this building right here, although it looks kind of new, they got new siding on it and stuff. One of these buildings used to be a, uh, a building from the train depot for the interurban railroad when it passed through um, from the suburban areas uh, east of Cleveland uh, into Cleveland and the eastern suburbs of Cleveland. So, but that's the, uh, that's the Geauga County Fairgrounds, the Great Geauga County Fair.